Hey, what's going on, Art Adventures? Welcome back. So today, we're gonna use these connects. We're gonna build this cool little, real basic, simple go-kart. All right, guys, so for the first step, this is what we're gonna need. Four of the white connectors, two yellow connectors, and two of the red rods. First things first, we are going to connect um, these red rods to the yellow connectors, but we're gonna do it sideways. So we're gonna snap them on, make sure that they're able to slide like that. Snap on the second one in the same direction. Okay, and then snap the other red rod on the side there, another one on the side there. Take our four uh, white snowflakes or connectors. I like to call them snowflakes because they look like snowflakes and it's easier for the students to understand what I'm talking about when I say connectors, I say snowflakes instead. They know exactly what I'm talking about. Especially the element. Anyways, so now you're gonna have two rods, uh, red, that have these white uh, snowflakes or connectors that kind of look like wheels. This is gonna be the base of the actual car itself. These are just in place to hold it together so it's not um, kind of uh, fumbling in and out and it keeps these steady on the rods that we're gonna use. All right, for our next step, we're gonna need two of the medium-sized yellow rods and then eight of these tiny little pieces, which are kind of like these big washers or spacers is what I like to call them. Um, that's just gonna help us uh, with the um, tires that we're gonna be making. Um, you're gonna go ahead and put this yellow rod through both of the holes of each of the white snowflakes, okay? And balance it like that. Same thing on the other side. Yellow rod through the two white ones. That's gonna be our axles, okay? And then we're gonna put two on each edge, just like that. Two of these washers on each edge. Just like that. One, two. One, two. All right, and now for this next step, we're gonna need four tires. And when they come into the package, they come like this. You got the rim, then you actually have the wheel. So you gotta assemble those. It doesn't really matter which way, um, but this is your connector. You're gonna go down to the um, yellow rod and you're just gonna pop it on. Sometimes when you push it, okay, you might accidentally push the tire out a little bit too much. Just go to the back, give it a nice little even squeeze and it should go right back. In the way it's supposed to go. Put another tire on this side, another tire on the front axle, and then another tire, tire on the last one. So now you have the actual base of the car with the axle and everything. All right, so the last step for this easy go-kart is gonna be um, just these two flexible pieces. If you don't have these flexible pieces, you're gonna kinda have to make up your own um, uh, base for the top. And that's gonna be with maybe some of these green pieces or kind of, uh, they'll go here and they'll angle and then kind of connect them. Um, I have these pieces that kind of bend a little bit. Okay, they're flexible. Um, and so with that being said, I'm going to uh, go here to the top of one of these and it might be a little hard to see on screen but I'm gonna put it at the very very top of this snowflake here and another one on the top of the other so it's coming straight up looks kind of wonky right now what we're gonna do is we're gonna bend this and then it's going to connect to the next open space right after this red rod this red rod is gonna have one space taken up and there's gonna be V. It's gonna be in that little cup shape right there. Perfect connection. And that's gonna give you a slanted look to where uh, if you want it to be front facing where the front is the high part and the back is tailed out like this, or it could be the front is like this, a little bit more aerodynamic and it has the back that rolls out kind of like this. Now, another thing that we do have is if we wanted to take these two tires off and put, um, say, a smaller blue rod, 
and then connect the two smaller tires, like how I did in um, the tractor video. Um, that'll also work. And then you'll have two big tires and two small tires in the front, so on and so forth. So there's plenty of things that you guys can do. That's just a basic, simple one, guys. Um, hope you guys enjoyed that. I'm gonna go ahead and get a couple more uh, designs to you guys. And I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. If you like what you see, give a thumbs up. I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.